everyone. In this session of CCNA series, I'll discuss about one of the Cisco wireless architecture called Autonomous AP. The primary function of access point is to bridge the wireless capable uh, devices to devices available on the wired network to share the data. So APs can be networked together in variety of architectures. The size and scalability of the network determine which architecture is most suited for a given implementation. There are three different Cisco wireless architecture that we can use in our network. Starting with autonomous AP, cloud-based and split MAC address architecture. So let's go ahead and look at the first one that is autonomous AP. An autonomous AP is a self-contained device. It is a standalone management Cisco wireless access point architecture, which is equipped with both wireless hardware and wired hardware to serve wireless clients and to connect them to the wired network. The autonomous AP can offer more than one standalone basic service sets and connect SSIDs to VLANs. Here in this topology, access points are offering two SSIDs, office and guests. These SSIDs correspond to wired VLAN 10 and 20 respectively. Those VLANs are trunked from the distribution layer, switched to the access layer and further extended to the access point. Each autonomous AP must also be configured with a management IP address so that it can remotely uh, accessed using Telnet, SSH or a web interface. And to configure the SSID or uh, which channel to use and what power levels to use. For management traffic to pass through the trunk, we have assigned uh, VLAN 100. Each access point in this architecture must be individually managed and maintained using a management platform such as Cisco DNA Center. One of the biggest disadvantage of this type of architecture is the network configuration and efficiency can become cumbersome as the network expands. In a large enterprise with hundreds and thousands of APs, it, it can bring large workload and it can bring high costs. So it is more suitable for small office networks. That's it for this session. I hope this was informative for you. Thank you for watching. Please do like, share and subscribe. Thank you.